The Trade Department is studying the possibility of partially reopening restaurants for dine-in services. But Secretary Ramon Lopez says they will first check if these establishments can apply health protocols to ensure the safety of diners. Lynn Olavario reports. Since the enforcement of the community quarantine protocols across the country, most fast food chains and restaurants have been allowed to offer takeout and delivery services. As for fine dining and experiential restaurants that don't usually offer takeaways and deliveries, going back to business is still a big challenge. And with lockdown measures still in place, the only option left for these establishments is to adapt. The Gallery by Chela and BGC decided to open this weekend and offered a new delivery and takeaway menu. To give a dining experience is first, but we need to reinvent ourselves. We have no choice. If you ask me this question three, four months ago, I will say this is, this is not possible. But you know, you need to adjust to the situation. Strict safety measures are being implemented at the restaurant. Beginning as soon as the staff gets off the elevator, his bags and belongings will be sanitized. Clean clothes will be donned. And temperature will be checked. Basically, we don't want anything from outside go inside of the restaurant. Even the raw foods such as vegetables are being cleaned. These measures, as well as the biodegradable packaging of their takeaways, entail additional costs for them. But for Chef Chela, the mindset right now is really just to survive. At the end of the day, our goal is all the same, to make sure that the business is alive and in the future, near future, to make some money. The Trade Department has recommended an accreditation system to the IATF where restaurant owners may apply for a permit to offer dine-in services. Uh, so maybe in the next two weeks, pag, uh, pag prepare sila, yung mga ready na, pwede tayo magkaroon ng accreditation system. So, ganun ho. Ang, I think yung intention natin ho lahat dito ay mabuksan na sa madalong madaling panahon, pero the safest way then. Secretary Mon Lopez notes that the complete guidelines that will be required for dine-in services and the accreditation system will be announced once approved by the IATF. Chief Implementer Carlito Galvez Jr. sees no problem. For as long as health guidelines and safety measures are strictly followed. Uh, sa dining siguro, pagka nakita natin, naging maganda yung performance ng ating, ano, ng ating uh, paghihigpit at saka maganda yung uh, naging uh, condition natin, pwede tayo mag-open ng 25% or 30%. And then later, pagka lalong gumanda yung conditions ng ano natin, ng uh, naging mababa ang COVID uh, ano natin, yung uh, transmission, pwede natin i-open up na 30% up to 50%. For News 5, Lynn Olivario, we are one you.